Kale Miracle 2018 Clip and Lady Open Champion. Crazy match. Uh, let's talk about the ending of the match. You're up 3 0 and 3 1. 3 1. End up giving up a cradle out of bounds with a turn. Uh, ref shows four. What's going through your mind? The last, you know, 15 seconds of the match, I remember seeing the clock and I think it said 17. Um, I was just kind of holding on, which shouldn't be my mentality you know I should still be working to score the whole time so I got to work on that but um, once they um, awarded her the two and the two I was like oh no like gotta like recollect myself get ready to go out go out after it and get a takedown um, and so we threw in the block and the call went our way um, I had Emma over on the side and she was like when this doesn't go your way because she was so sure that we weren't gonna get the call she's like you need to know what you're going for and so I was getting that in my mind. I was like, all right, what am I going to set up? You know, two seconds on the clock, what can I get? Um, but then, thankfully, the call went our way. So I just had to circle and not flee the hold or do anything silly like that because then she would have had the, the win right there. But was able to hold her off and get it done. And what, were you, what was your thoughts? Uh, would you have given it two or two, two and two? I'll have to go back and watch to see what um, I think the call is. Obviously, I would say, oh, it's just just the two turn, you know, um, just because it goes my way. But I'll have to look, and maybe I just got, you know, some good refs on my side. So we'll see. Uh, improvements. You were in deep several times, left leg. Um, your right side, head on the inside. How moving forward do you improve on that position because you didn't get too many finishes um, aside from the takedown. So how do you work forward um, from here on? So that right side single, um, that sweep, is one of my main moves. And anyone who watches any of my matches uh, would know that. So I'm not giving any secrets away. Um, but I've been working on that a lot this year, um, especially with Coach Izzy out at the training center, just trying to, you know, refrain from locking my hands and just letting myself get extended but staying posted and working and that's just a work in progress I'm trying to drill it and it's just got to become muscle memory so hit it a couple thousand more times and maybe I'll be decent at it uh, but then just that fighting mentality um, there were a few times when I definitely could have gotten the score especially in that last 25 seconds I'm in I peeked my head out and I just kind of stopped and I was like you know I can just chill here I'll let some time go by when really I could have scored and um, put myself in a little bit of a safer sp position. So. Now let's talk about where you're headed next. I know you guys, especially you, have been on a journey. Uh, Four-time WCWA national champion. Now you come to Sweden, and where are you going next? My next step, I'm not not sure. Um, finished with the college season, so. I'm done with that. I'll stay in the room and keep training. I have awesome training partners. Uh, Coral Sugiyama is here wrestling 59 kilos, and then Grace Bullen is also in the room, and she just won the 59 kilo bracket. So, you know, I, we have some hammers in there, so I'm getting better. Um, but then for my next competition, I know for sure I have U23 World Team Trials. Um, so hopefully I'll make another team and have my chance at getting a gold there because I came up short earlier this year. All right, well, thank you and congratulations. Thank you.